ABCD is a kite where AD equals AB. Okay, find the size of the smallest angle of the kite. Now, to do this, we have to think about the properties of a kite. Now, even though this has got a bigger like segment than that, it doesn't mean that these two are different. In fact, the properties of the kite means that these two angles are the same. So we've got something we can work with now. Okay, so we know that 5x minus 147 is the same as 2x. Now this is an equation we can solve. To solve it, I need to get my x's on one side, my numbers on the other side. Okay. Um, I'm going to minus 2x from both sides. Because okay. I always like to just subtract the lowest number of x's. 5x minus 2x is 3x. I haven't touched my 147. 2x minus 2x is 0. This 147, because I need to get rid of it, it's already a negative, so I need to plus 147. Plus 147 from both sides. Which means I've got 3x equals 147. Okay, to get x on its own, I need to divide it by 3. Divide it by 3. So x equals, that's quite a big number, and I don't know how to divide it. So I need to think about my bus stop method. 3, 147. Okay. 3 goes into 1, 0 times. I need to carry the 1 over. 3 goes into 14. It's going to be 4 times. Okay, to make 12. 13, 14. Which means I've got 2 left over. 3 times 27 is 9. So my angle, my x is 49. Okay. Now if we go back up to my shape, this actually then goes on to say that this angle here is 2 times 49. Okay, which is, I'll do it the long way to make sure it's right. So 49 plus 49, 9 plus 9 is 18, carry the 1, 4 plus 4 is 8, plus 1 is 9, so this is 98 degrees, okay, uh, this one here, 5x minus 147, so we have to do 5, and my value of x is 49, minus 147, okay, 5 times 49 I can't do off the top of my head, so I'm going to split up into my grid method, 14 and 9. And you may think this is a lot of working out, but I'd rather do it properly than messing up. Uh, 5 times 4 is 20, add on my 0. Uh, 5 times 9 is 40. Add them together, you get 245. Okay. When you've done that, I've got this is 245, so I need to minus 147. So I'm just going to do it for the head of it. And by the way, some of you might be able to work out what the actual answer is. Uh, 5 minus 7 I can't do, so I have to borrow off this to make it 15. 15 minus 7, so 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 is 8. 3 minus 4 I can't do, so I need to borrow. 13 minus 4 is uh, 9. Okay, 1 minus 1 is 0. And uh, we've got 98. But to be honest with you, we knew it was 98. As I said at the start, these two equal. Okay. Now we need to think of another property of the kite because we need to find out this angle here. Okay. Now, I assume this one's going to be the smallest because it looks the smallest and it is a kite. That's a property of a kite. But let's work it out and be aware that if it's over 98, we'd have to state one of these. So, and in a lot of chances, this is going to be the smallest angle. Uh, a kite is a quadrilateral. We know something about a quadrilateral. We know that all the angles add up to 360. So, we know 98 plus 98 plus 116 plus something is 360, and this will be your something. So, let's do this a long way then. Okay. Right, so I've got 98 plus 98 plus 116. Okay, eight plus eight is 16, plus six makes 22. Nine plus nine is 18, plus one is 19, plus two is 21. Well, one plus two is three, so this is 312. So I have to do 360 minus 312. A 0 minus 2 I can't do, so I need to borrow. 10 minus 2 is 8. 5 minus 1 is 4. 3 minus 3 is 4. So it's 48 degrees. 40, so this one here is 48 degrees. That's your smallest angle. So that's your answer, 48 degrees.